Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to connect Square to WooCommerce in 2023. So today we're gonna explore like the seamless integration of Square, which is a versatile payments processing platform with your WooCommerce store. So if you're ready to offer like some secure and convenient payments options, make sure to stick around and let's delve into the step-by-step -step process of connecting Square to your WooCommerce site. So make sure to stick by, let's dive right into this video and simply let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch us from now till the end so you have full experience. First, we'll have to go and open whatever browser you're going to use to follow this tutorial episode. Here in my case, I'm actually going to use the Brave browser. And of course, in your case, you're going to use any other browser that you could possibly have. Once you open this browser, so for me, as I said, I'm going to use Brave. So once you open this browser, you'll have to go and sign up for a Square account. To do so, you go and visit the Square website and sign up for a Square account. So go to the URL section, basically just type square.com and hit the enter button. This should take you into the home screen or main screen of Square website. Go to the top right corner to sign up in or to sign in or to log in into your account if you have one. And if you don't, instead you'll have to go here and click on get started to create a new account for your own. If you don't know nothing about Square, you can simply here in the home screen, scroll down a bit to read more information about this website and how it's working. You can just have a general idea or basic information on this Square like payments method. And of course, here you can even find the frequent, frequently asked questions. I'll just open the answers here for you. You can post a video and read it all by your own. And yeah, I guess that's it. So if you have an account, just log in. If you don't, create some, a new one. So for me, I'll just go here and log in into my account. As an example, I'll click on sign in. And here, of course, I'll have to log in with using my email or phone, then password. Remind me next time. And continue to, to square. I don't want to add my phone number. And of course, for you, make sure to add a phone number because this will add more security to your account and you will be like ready to go. So once you set up your account and you're ready to use, you'll have now to go and open your WooCommerce website. So go to woo.com. Of course, from the same time for me, I'll just open my local host because I'll have to access the plugins. And of course, just go again and sign up your, your account. So for me, I'm already signed up. Uh, sign up if, to a new account if you don't have a WooCommerce website. And if you have, just go and log into that. Then just go to your plugins so once you go to your plugins of course you'll have to go to the bottom left corner go and click on add the new plugin in here and of course this will take you to this page so in here you'll have to scroll down go here to search plugins and basically here you'll have to look for square so sorry and hit the enter button and let's see so as you can see we have here woocommerce square so you can uh, initiate the integration from here. For me at the moment, as you can see, I cannot install it. Why? Because this plugin does not work with my PHP version. For me, I have like an old version. For you, if you have like the latest version, you'll be able to do so. You'll be able to download this or you can simply just go and click on learn more about updating if you have the same problem and just go and follow the steps provided here to install it out. So for you, what you'll have to do is simply go and install this plugin. You'll find an install now like this. As an example, go and click on that. Once it's installed, you will have to click on activate. In the meantime, of course, I'll just show you here more details about it. Basically, in more details, I guess they will even show you everything. So no need even for me to show you stuff. But of course, that's if you want to like initiate the plugin connection or yeah, if you want to initiate the connection from plugins from WooCommerce, you can even try to... Uh, initiate the connection from Square. So I'll show you how, but at the moment, as you can see, if you click on more details, you'll find here the description, installation, how to install this example, and frequently asked questions, change logs, screenshots, and how it's working. Basically, so once you install and click on activate, you will have settings like that. So you'll basically have to click on connect to your Square, and you'll have to enter your information, and you'll be basically uh, logged in. You'll have to add your payments now, and basically, you'll be good to go. Of course, you can even see the reviews of other people. As you can see, some of them given to one star. Maybe they have like some errors because it's block it's plugins on WooCommerce. Errors may occur and they will be resolved if they have like a good 
person that will keep updating like WooCommerce, like it will keep updating their app, especially if people are using it and asking for updates. So you gotta provide some reviews also if you have problems like these guys so they can uh, install or give you some updates. That if you want to do the connection, as I said, from Square, uh, from WooCommerce. If you want to start it from Square, you can simply go to your Square, go to this left panel as example, and make sure here to go and click on settings. Once you click on settings, you'll find this app integrations. So go and click on that. Once you do so, you will be taken to this page. So as you can see here, Squarespace uh, or Square, sorry, no space. So Square app marketplace from accounting apps and e-commerce solutions to inventory and employee management. So Square works for, with apps for any need. So click on visit app marketplace. This should open a new tab for you, which is the Square app marketplace. Here, what you will basically have to look for is simply WooCommerce. So go and look for WooCommerce. And as you can see, you'll find the WooCommerce app right here. So go and click on that. And once you do so, you'll be taken to their screen. As you can see, build an online store synced with your in-person business to manage one platform. So you'll find about features, pricing, which is free. So you don't have to worry about paying anything. And yeah, that's it. So you basically have to go here and click on get started as simple as that. And of course, this will open a new tab. So we'll have to wait. So in here, you'll have to simply go and download this. Of course, if you want to read any information, just go and read it out in here to have general idea on how the like the connection will be. You can see even people here are giving it a lot of five stars. And let's see. Simply go here and click on free download. So you can see what's included, in example, supports and etc. Whatever you want to know. And yeah, as simple as that. So you'll have to simply go and click on proceed to checkout. For me, it's zero dollars. And you'll have to fill up, of course, your information as an example in here. So we'll just fill those out. Why not? For me, I'll just enter some random information for you. Make sure to enter like uh, information that are real. So I'll just enter that. And how would you use our products? Store owner, I'll just use that. And of course, if you'd like to get the woo.com to send me updates about products, exclusive promotion, and discount, I can. Uh, can opt, of course, out of receiving this communication at any time for me. I'm not even going to check it because I don't want to. And of course, I'll click on pay. It's zero dollars, so they'll not uh, charge me anything. Don't worry about that. Once it's paid, of course, you will have to simply go and add it to your site, your Square site. Of course, this is for WooCommerce, so as you can see, WooCommerce.com. You'll have to add it to your uh, Square or add Square to your site. You can even add Stripe. Uh, as you can see, it's added here. And yeah, that's it. It will be already added. You can even, like, after that, configure the Square settings, set up the Square payment option, whatever you want, and test even the Square payments by your own, then go live and accept payments using it. Then you'll be able, of course, to monitor the Square transactions. And yeah, you'll be good to go. So that's it. For you, of course, already congratulations. You've successfully connected Square as a payments gateway into your WooCommerce store. So thank you for joining me and here to this seamless and secure payments processing Square, which of course with WooCommerce. So thanks for watching. And if you like this video, make sure to leave a like down below. Subscribe to our channel for more helpful tools like this one. And I'll catch you in the next video.